Hey guys, welcome back to Electrical Car Repair Live. Thank you guys for watching and subscribing to the channel. Today will be super helpful for you guys to any of you having a Kia vehicle. If you guys have a Kia vehicle and the ambient temperature sensor reading is not working on your dash, it doesn't show anything, maybe it just says lines and empty, uh, we'll explain uh, top three things that can cause that. Make sure to stand till the end. We'll explain where most likely the sensor is located and what to look for. Even though we're demonstrating on Kia Optima, the video should be helpful on multiple Kia models and some of those could be Kia Optima for this Sportage, Sorento, uh, Kia So and Kia Rio as well. So let's go ahead and start on it now. So let us guys tell us a little bit about us. Every single car we get at the garage we try to make at least two to three hundred free repair videos. We try to take them completely apart and show you how to fix pretty much anything. Why we do that? Simply because our mission in the shop is to save you as much money as we can. All we need in return guys please subscribe to the channel and like the video. Something else, if you need to buy parts, tools for your Kia vehicle, we'll share the links in the description of the video below where we get all our tools and parts from. Check it out, parts for really good price and quick shipping as well. In addition guys, if you want to save even more money and learn how to fix your car for free, check out our main channel, How to Repair guys, you can find so much helpful information that can save you thousands of dollars on future car repairs guys. We, uh, we, have, we have helped more than 100 million people on this channel, so let's start on it now. So, let me show you what you need to do. You need to come right in the middle of the bumper, guys, right here. If you crawl underneath, okay, let me come here now on that key, guys. Okay, and you're going to see in the middle of the radiator support, right here, okay, right in the middle. Let me, let me get more light because, okay, perfect. Oh, no, that's perfect. I just need to situate the camera. Right there, that's your ambient temperature sensor. That's the wiring harness. You have to make sure it's plugged in. Make sure the wire is not broken, disconnected, contaminated. That could happen if you hit a snow drift or anything like that could happen, guys. So you can break the wire sometimes. This is the sensor right here. You just uh, use uh, use uh, prying to okay plastic clip prying to to pull it out this is the sensor itself if you need to replace it on a Kia vehicle guys and I'll try to put the link in the description of the video below where you can get it from now things to look for wiring harness not to be disconnected wiring harness that's not broken make sure the okay right here the pins did not curl on the phone and another thing guys make sure the sensor itself is not bad if everything else checks out fine most likely you have a bad sensor so hopefully guys the video will be helpful to any of you having that problem thank you for watching and see you guys next time 